Hey everyone, uh, this is Dave Richter with Richter Scale Studios. I am showing you right now my new paint shaker by Robart. Um, I just got this in the mail today off of eBay from uh, DNS Hobbies out of Florence, South Carolina. It only took about a week to get it and everywhere else I tried to get one, it is back ordered. So uh, just look up Robart, R-O-B-A-R-T, a hobby paint shaker. Uh, you should be able to find one online somewhere. I think they'll going to start being available sometime in the first week of August. <clears throat> I want to show you what I'm going to do in a test on. Shaking paints is a pain, and sometimes you just got to pound it to get the uh, pigment back up. I have a, a there we go, a um, container of game color desert yellow, and if you see right here on my uh, little dry wet palette, put it on there. It is just wet. So uh, I'm going to. Put it up on the uh, shaker in a second, and we'll give it a shake for say like 20 seconds, and uh, give it a test again. I'll be right back. Hey everyone, I'm back. It is on the paint shaker. It's got this little rubber strap with little holes in it. It looks like if this wears out, I could probably just use like a rubber band like this and just double it up, save a couple bucks. I think I've seen these things on eBay for like five or five bucks and plus shipping. So uh, let's see if I just how these rubber bands work in the future. But I'm gonna push the button right now and time it. Now you can see the uh, shaker is trying to move away, so I might have to make some kind of mounting system for it. This might be a time saver too while you're uh, using another color you're planning to use another one you notice it's uh, separated just throw this on here it's a little annoying but it might be uh, save your wrist a little bit that's a cool little gadget to have on your paint station now that's a little over 20 seconds and i'll be right back okay everyone i am back and let's give this a test and that is paint so 20 seconds and no uh, carpal tunnel or anything, and we have pure mixed paint. So I do recommend this. If you can grab one, it's fun. And also a little time saver, and you know, us in the hobbies uh, always like having our neat little gadgets and tools. So uh, thank you for watching, and please subscribe. I'll have some more videos in the future soon. Thanks.